Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Deck Deck, and today we're playing some more Mind Tree. Now, I've got some things to show you in a second, but we've got a boss coming in, so let's show the boss off first. Oh, we've got loads of them. Now, let's see if I can distract these so they don't destroy my menders this time. The distraction worked. <laughs> I got wrecked, but the distraction worked. That is a problem. Uh, I need junctions there to stop that from happening. Uh, it's too late, isn't it? Destroy that, destroy that, destroy that. You go there, you go there, you go there, and you come in. No, oh, there was more tighter. Uh, more, what's it called there? I fully expect there's going to be more there as well. Yeah. Is that a router? No, it's a junk. It's from there. God damn it. You need to go there. Really? That causes a slight problem. It's going to have to be fine like that. It's not like I've not got titanium already. Um, anyway, right. I was recommended, let me just pause it for a second, and I'm going to butcher your name, I do apologise. Uh, I got a comment from Obadiah Halaby. Apologies if that's wrong. Uh, your designs are kinder, dot dot dot, bad, no offence. <laughs> Thanks for that. Uh, by any chance, are you on the Mind History Discord? Uh, I basically said, could you make it more constructive criticism than just criticism? And I got back, don't get me wrong, your designs machines are working, but you can make them better and more efficient and get the maximum output out of them, that's all. And then he recommended e Ecan in-game server. And just go and have a look at some of the dudes on there. I went and had a look at some of the dudes on there. And I like some of their designs. Um, like this. I could make this more efficient. Do I really need to make my graphite more efficient? We're currently just shipping it away, so no, not really. Uh, is there any... I mean, I don't really want to rip apart anything, honestly, because it's working quite well. They used this sort of thing quite a lot. The only op uh, difference they used from what I saw is they have, like, coal, sand, coal, sand, coal, sand, whereas I give coal, coal, sand, sand. But they swapped router junction, router junction, router junction. Similar to how I've done it, a bit different. Um, again, this sort of thing, they just alternated it, but I think this is working quite well at the minute. Why are they not producing? Because it's completely blocked up. Um, let me get a large launch pad right there. And we're going to have a overflow gate right there. And then you're going to go in there. So then we can get that going back. I am sending everything back, right? Nothing's completely stalling out. No, not really. I mean, surely this is splitting it evenly, right? If I got rid of that and just put a normal router there, then it's definitely going to split it evenly. You kind of get full for a minute. Realistically, I don't need this one coming in here anymore. Yeah, let's get rid of that. And you're just going to come straight down like that, because this is all going to be filtering into its own one all the way up here. Uh, we wanted to boost these a little bit more. I did see a better way of me doing it last time. When I watched the last bit of my episode back. Put one of them there very quickly. We did just waste everything that was in that line, but... I can now put one of them there. Get rid of that. Put one of them there and one of them there. So we don't need that. And we don't really need that anymore. 
It just gives us more storage space for our slag. Uh, this is the sort of thing they do as well, which, amusingly, I've only just started using, but it's nicer. Don't set the thing on fire. That will go out in a second, right? There we go. Get rid of that one as well. Why do you keep setting it on fire? Stop that. Is it going to do it again? So really what we're missing here is lead. I mentioned last time how I wanted to try and fix this. Oh, they're not really stalling out anymore, are they? No, they are not. Well, I guess that's as good as we're getting for Surge Alloy on this map then. And really, having these go into incinerators is a stupid idea. Because what I can do instead is have get you go into... Why can I not build one of them? There's a goddamn mine there. Nope. Not that close, because then it's going to interact with the sorters. You can just go like that instead. <clears throat> then I can at least uh, sell off the graphite rather than losing it all. Why is that now not working? Why is it letting lead through? You shouldn't be letting lead through. Really? I don't get why it's doing that. Or is it coming back out of the router? So that could be a problem. I honestly don't know, but we are wasting lead. It's not much. But it is still wasting it. I don't know. We've got Surge Alloy coming in. Admittedly, not very well, but... Can I continue to build some of these now? I can at least build a couple more of these. Now, I did go ahead off camera and play around with these a little bit to make them look somewhat neater. If I put that one there and connect you to that one, then cryofluid comes in here and we can get another one of these built up. You're now full of ammo. That container is still full. It's going to take forever to build this up. I need to get some defences over this way as well. But I kind of like the base I've got going on this one. It may not be the most efficient, but it's somewhat decent. We're real short on Surge Alloy. Again, it's just because I'm sending Meta Glass back. You guys are full. I could expand this. I don't really want to expand this. Now, why is that one more full? 7.8, 6 point whatever. These aren't managing to outload everything, are they? No, not really. Uh, what I could actually do... No, because it's not really going to help matters. I don't know. I actually don't know. I mean, I'm still doing fine for power. Oh, we've got a boss. What boss do we have? Then things stand absolutely no chance. All of these are indefinitely going to be full of cryofluid. See, they are very, very slowly filling back up. Wow. I really haven't got any Surge Alloy at all, have I? Well, I need Surge Alloy. Why is lead always so difficult to get?
I could take more scrap from here as well, but I don't... I just need somewhere to build this bigger and better. I've got no room. I did say about taking this battery bank out. And moving it across this side. But is that really a wise idea? Hmm. Hmm. It's like I, I've designed this base. I've not really got much room because it's that thin. I'm gathering a nice amount of resources, everything apart from Surge Alloy. I don't get why you're not working 100% of the time when everything else is. Say even the titanium's working 100% of the time. No, it's not. I saw titanium go through then. It's because they're going into routers, isn't it? Well, in uh, that case... Let me just do that. And get rid of that. You're going to be copper. You're going to be... Lead, you're going to be titanium. That's going to go away. You're going to go there, there, there. And you're going to go up. And then come back into a thingamajig. And then we'll see if that works out better. Hopefully it won't keep passing the lead by. Apparently, it won't work. Now it's because the leads at uh, the titanium's full up. Oh, that could be a little bit of a problem. But at least now looking at it, the leads all filtering through. Yeah, I just need more lead so I can get this working quicker. Because at the minute, I bet only one of these machines is even partly working. I didn't really miss any lead on this section. Why is there so much titanium and so little lead? I was about to say, are they all meant to be pumping water there? Yes, they are. We're definitely not going to have enough surge alloy to build that one up. Nope. Right, screw it. We're setting it up so that I can make more of this stuff. Sorry, battery bank. I am going to fill it out more down here, though. We'll just cover that scrap up. Uh, that's probably going to need one of them there as well. Why would you start from the middle like that? Just do that. And that. And that. We'll get all these built up and then I'll build more of a factory for this bit. And I want to try and do it in a more organised way because this is just like, it's not even controlled chaos, it's just chaos. <clears throat> I can use uh, containers and stuff as well. Or I can even use vaults. Can I use vaults? Yep, titanium and thorium. That way we won't have the backup problem that I'm having now. That's it, get the batteries built up. I'd probably not got as many as I had before, but it's a nice uh, backup power supply. Dum, 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 dum. Good man. Nearly there. So, so, I'm just going to rip all of that out. Get rid of all of it. We're not doing that. You go there, get rid of that, get rid of that. 
we'll get rid of all of it. I'll leave that line from that point onwards then. Anything else I can get rid of? That right there. You can go like that. You can go like that. You can go like that. Uh, you don't need to be there. You don't need to be there. Right, that's better. So if I have my sorting lot up here. Uh, ma -ma 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 -ma. Where have they gone? Vaults. I'm going to leave, leave enough space in case I want to get more than one line in. Why have I done that many for a start? I only get four resources out of this. And I can get rid of them. Because I'm going to do that bit slightly differently as well. Uh, where are we going? I want the separators. That's probably going to be way too much. Let me go like that. And like that. Then I can have like liquid routers along there. There's no reason to put it on the end like that, but I'm going to. And I can just copy that and paste that right there. Build the pipes in first, otherwise it's all going to catch fire. Ah, oh dear. And from that point on, please don't burn anything. We've got all these different lines. I knew that was going to happen. You know what? I'm going to quickly get a wave in here as well. That's a fuse now. Where's the wave gone? Right there. And give me a water extractor. Oh, they've got no power. Ugh. Just until all the fire's gone out. You're still pumping that out. I just wasted a load of that. Stop it. Stop. Stop it. That's fine for now. I think we can get rid of this again then. Watch it catch fire again in a second and me be dead upset. Um, you know what, actually? If I did that, that don't you dare. That's going to melt, isn't it? Ah. It has got a huge range. Let's put that there, then. And it's not being powered. Stupid me. Oh, it is being powered. It's full of slag. God damn it. Try that one again. This is going to blow up again. Oh! You just saved it. Right. I, I didn't really want to spend two episodes doing just this, but apparently we are. Uh, now, how am I going to get these all down where I need them to go? You know what the easiest option would be? Use some phase conveyor belts for this. So then I can cut all of this middle bit out. Let me just get rid of all these lines. Yeah, like I say, I didn't really want to spend all of this episode doing this again. Because I did it last time. But, 
at the minute we kind of need to so we're gonna Uh, so you need power for a start. Uh, where's the little ones? Right there. And uh, that powers all of that. That powers all of that. They now work. You're coming there. You're going uh, this away and down there. Thorium goes straight down, and you're my surge alloy. Because I didn't want these lines being, like, contaminated by each other. We're keeping them all coming in. Of their own accord. Oh, the spaghetti continues. One, two, three, four. Almost like I planned it. Now, let's go just to there for now. And you're going to come to there. You're going to come to here. We're making as much use of this slag as we can. Alrighty then. Now, does sorters next to each other all work? Is the question. Because amusingly, I don't think it will. No, leave that one. All planning this is... Well, it's not planning, it's all testing. Whether the testing works out or not is a different matter. I'm just going to leave a one gap between these. And my plan is... Inverted sorter. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Copper, 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 copper. Lead, lead, lead. They're all staying as titanium. They're all staying as going to graphite. And then I believe I'm just going to need to fill all the rest of this in with junctions. I think this is a terrible design, by the way. But, if it works out... And you're going to go in there, in there, in there, and in there. Now, they are all flowing. Which is exactly what I wanted to see. Now, how do we go about making this work? Because that is a load of resources coming in dead quickly and we're still not eating through all the slag, honestly. But there's plenty of all of it coming in. Yeah, that's working quite well. Right, next thing. Uh, we need the alloy smelters. I've lost it again. There we go. It needs three of them all coming in. And l we can get silicon on the far side. I highly doubt this will be enough. So I'm going to do it from there. I'm just going to have one line coming out the middle of each. Obviously, I've got to have an offloader thing coming from there. Um, underflow. This one's going to have to be a little bit different, the first one. Because you're going to have to have underflow there. We'll do it on the first one of each one. Underflow, 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 underflow. Can you see where I'm going with this yet? And can you see if it's going to work or not yet? Uh, you're going to need a unloader there, there, and there. You go in, you go in, you go in, you go in, you go in. You 
You go in. You go in. You go in. So why is the copper not being unloaded? Because it's an underflow gate. It needs to be an overflow gate. And you just need to go in there. Not like that. Same as you just need to go in there. Not like that. I've done this one tile too close. Mm. Just save it there a minute. Cut all this away. Just going to move it all down one. Now, all of my things have stalled out. That tells me I've probably filled up on copper. Which isn't really what I wanted. Because then that's going to stop all the rest of them. <clears throat> You go there. I can get rid of that one, that one, and that one. And I can put unloader there, there, there. Get rid of that one. Then that can be an underflow gate. If this all works, I'll be more amazed than anybody. It is somewhat working. Then they just need silicon. Which... Bring you out one more. Bring you around and down like that. Where have they just pulled all this rubbish from? Right there. You go like that. Hopefully the boss will be fine. Really this doesn't matter because it's all going to go into a... Well, no, it's not all going to go into a thing. I think I've sorted it all out now. Yeah, you can go like that. I needed to bring this a bit further. My bad. Come more down like that. Go into there because then I can just get underflow gates... Do it along the top line there, 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 and there. I bet I run out of silicon now. Like that. And then you should just be able to come out like this. Oh, it looks such a mess. Uh, we can just get some little power doodars along there. Now, when the first ones are filled up with silicon, the bottom one should get it, because I don't think silicon's going to be the limiting factor, although it might be. That's working better. Copper is a little bit of a concern. You know what's something I wanted to check as well? When I went on this other server, they just got, like, pulverizers in the middle of nowhere... And it was pulverizing stuff. Don't put it there. Put it somewhere that's going to get power at least. Like right there. Does that actually just make sand? I know what I want to try. No, I think they'd put it on just a random piece of scrap. I don't understand then, because they just had pulverizers that were making sand from nowhere. I don't quite get that one. Um, I know what this could be. 
underflow, underflow, underflow. No, 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 no. That won't work because I've got the other ones next to it. I needed slightly more space there. Although it is only copper that's going to be a problem. So if I have an underflow gate there and an incinerator there, any extra copper I can just burn. Because I'm not going to have extra lead. I'm not going to have extra titanium. And the graphite I really should just be sending back. Now, why is this middle one not working? Now it's working. It's not working because it's all coming from there. Can I not just have an underflow gate there? Nope. No, I can't. It's somewhat working better, but it's not. And I don't know if this would work. You need to be copper, you need to be copper, you need to be copper. It does actually look like they would work like that. You know what? I'm going to clear all this away and we're going to try this one then. I didn't think these would work like this. I really should go and check to make sure they've not destroyed anything up top. Again, the trial and error. We're learning. See, the copper's coming down and then being pushed out of the other way. So it's not really working how I want it to. Which is why I did it diagonally. I don't think there's any way to change that now. Fine, I'm just going to have to leave it like that. Get rid of that. Let's throw this all back in as copper. I will stop swapping these around at some point this episode. I mean, it's not like we've not got a lot of surge alloy coming in from this. Although it could be better, I guess. Uh, go there, go there, go there. Nope. I need junctions from this point on. It does work. I just need to get rid of copper more efficiently. And if I'd have planned it out better and had more space... It would have worked. Just make sure they've only got the certain thing in. Uh, I need you to be a large launch pad right there. Just so I can start extending the graphite away. Nope, that needs to be an unloader between it. God damn it. You're now waiting for loads of titanium, but it's because the copper's blocked up. Right, the easiest way to sort this, then, is just going to be to have an unloader there. And get that straight into an incinerator. I, I dare bet we get enough copper coming in anyway to not be that bothered by this. That can go there. I'll get an unloader there. Well, why not just have three? And then we can completely make sure. Right, all these lines that should continuously move. I actually think we need even more.
you're going to make a bit of a feedback loop there, aren't you? That's not what I want either. Get rid of that. It's trying to keep up now. The lines are continuously flowing. Yeah, you are just capping out. But that is more lead coming in, and that is more surge alloy coming in, so really there's no complaints here. Honestly, I bet I can get one of them right there. Then that really should eat through all the copper. Oh, the boss's health has stopped going down. Why did the boss's health stop going down? Is it dead? Oh, they destroyed a couple of walls. How dare you? How dare you? Wow, we're at 36 minutes already. That flew past. But how many of these can we make now that I've done faffing about? Quite a few, actually. Quite a few. I do like this defense. Admittedly, they are trying to go straight through here, but... They're going to struggle. It is going to take them a while. And honestly, if they're going to keep trying to go through there, I could always just fill these blocks in with more menders. I don't know if it'd heal them quicker. Now, how would I go about getting power across this way and doing something similar over here? I don't think I can. I don't think we need that there anymore. We don't. No! I've not quite got enough to build that up, but I've got enough to make it get going. Um, let's just put two of them over this way. You can have one of them. You can have one of them. Don't waste it all, you moron. Get one of them there. Get an unloader there and there. I can have a phase conduit jumping across uh, there. You can come in there. I mean, I don't really need a phase conduit for this bit, but I'm going to get one. There you go. I don't want that joining up like that, then. And I want a router right there. And I'm a moron. You can go there. You can go there. And then you want... Nope. There and there. Because I need more unload. Can you tell that I don't really use the unloaders? Or haven't been using them that much? So then I've got a bit of defense around this side as well. Which will help out a great deal. We're only on wave 34, which is the scary thing. Right, how is all this working now? You've nearly burnt through all that copper. So I'm going to turn these... Is that going up? That's going down still. I'm going to shut both of them off for now. But I'm still going to leave them in the system. You're fully stocked. You're fully stocked. You need copper. Amusingly, we are now running out of copper. It's not that we're running out. It's just it needs to fill up more. How are we doing for slag? We've actually run out of that as well. How would I make that more efficient? Really? Really? <clears throat> Get rid of that one. That's not helped matters. No! Please don't destroy it. 
please. Come on. There we go. Well, I could just plop another one of these right in the middle. And that then would give it more of an output. Let's go like that, and then it should split it evenly between them two. And then there's more scrap coming in. <clears throat> Technically, we could just have two machines for each. Do you think I could lay this out in a nicer way? I'm being dead finicky this episode, I'm aware. Two, three, four. So then you could come like this and in there. And you could go straight there. You could come up that way and you could go straight in there. And then I just need water, water, water. Water. And that right there. I think that's as efficient as we're going to get the slag factory going. And we've actually filled up on silicon and we're now surpassing this. Beautiful. We did run out of lead for a second though. Only if I wanted, I could always get more slag coming up this way. But, well, more scraps coming up this way, sorry, to make more slag. <clears throat> Hmm. Didn't I have more scrap somewhere? I buried it, didn't I? Under the batteries. And I bet that would jump across there, wouldn't it? It would. I could jump that. And get even more of this coming in. You know what? Sorry, batteries. My poor batteries. They've been annihilated this episode. I hate it when it just says power is zero, zero. Because I know you're lying to me. You know what? We might as well. We have nearly finished for this episode, by the way. Just grab all of this power. Because why the hell not? It's free power. And then I know where I can get batteries. There we go. There and there. And you can now come across there. That's not what I wanted. I did kind of want it to keep to the grid, but honestly, screw the grid. Beat the OCD. Oh, I could get one in there somewhere. There we go. There you go. And get a few more down this way, because I don't really think I need more copper coming in at this point. They are all joined together, right? Yeah, yeah, they are. Oh, dear. I wasn't meant to be recording my industry today, if I'm being honest. <clears throat> uh, I was meant to be recording more of the forest, but I went on that server and saw some other ideas. Not that I've really implemented many of them ideas, but I just liked it, how they were doing it. And I wanted to try and mimic it myself. Not that I've, again, mimicked anything that they were doing. It's more like for the graphite and for the uh, the silicon and stuff like that. That their ideas would come into play. And they are good ideas. I'll give them that. I, I don't need more copper. I've not even been making phase fabric on this map. What is that? Thorium and sand. Oh, really, I should do that at some point. My thorium slowed right down to a crawl, hasn't it? Are we filling them chests up at the top still, the containers? I think that might be it. But that thorium has slowed right down. I've got so much power coming in. Hopefully I'll not have the same problem I had on one of the other levels. I can see the titanium in the line there. takes so long. It takes so long. They're quicker. 
Just imagine all the power that I've lost from keep moving all these batteries. Goddamn idiot. Although it's not really going to take me long to get it back, is it? Dump. Dump. Oh, here comes the thorium. Yeah. I was uh, using it for other things, apparently. And you can just come down and go in there like that. The meta glass should be good again. Um, right. Get one there. I'm not actually sure about the placement on that one. Go like that. So then that can connect there, that can connect there, that can connect there. I'm not really fussed where it connects, honestly. And I'm going to need power coming in anywhere around there, please. Oh, I was doing this with water, wasn't I? Oh, why is all this backed up now? Because you're full. Yeah, if I had a better system in place, this would work loads nicer. You know what? Actually, I can set up a better system for this. I've just seen it. You need to be an overflow gate. Junction, junction, junction. Straight into an incinerator. And then it's going to keep all these full while getting rid of as much of it as it can. That's better. That's the sort of thing I wanted. No, I don't need two of them in. I think once this has got going a little bit, it will work out okay. Can I just copy that? Does it fit in here anywhere? Mm, it's a bit tight, isn't it? Would it fit down here somewhere? It would if I could move that water somewhere. It kind of goes like that. Screw it. Get rid of that. Let's copy you again. I'm going to finish this episode in a second. One of them's not really going to help matters, but it'll do. And you're going to come up and go in there. You're going to come down and go in there. I know this is a way overkill, but... And then the pipes can come up. Well, really? For starters, that can't go there anymore. Because that's going to interfere. Ooh, don't do that. You need to come up there and up there. And I'm making this far too complicated. I'm just not going to do it. We've got plenty of surge alloy coming in now. It's not going to break the bank. We're not getting ridiculous amounts, but we've got surge alloy coming in. And let's just leave it at that, shall we, before I ruin it. And we're at another 50 minute episode. I want to go back on one of the other maps. I want to go back on Nuclear Complex so I can spread things out again and do it properly. I'm not going to go back onto Nuclear Complex. I think we can say that we've claimed this level now. Because really, we're set up in a fashion where it's going to be very difficult to kill me. What are we missing still? Lead. They're meant to be junctions, aren't they? That might be why I'm having problems. Might be, not necessarily, but it might be. <clears throat> I 
Yeah, that is still having problems. We need to clear that out a little bit more. The copper is just way too much. And two of them at full capacity is kind of nice. Why are these now building up? Oh, it's because the lines are backed up. That's why. Never mind. We're going to leave it there or so I'm going to keep going forever. So, pause the game. That means we can't continue. It's been a dead front episode for me. I don't know about you guys, but building this monstrosity has kind of took it out of me. So I want to go and calm down for the night. That is going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more comments and feedback. Greatly appreciated as always. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers. <laughs>